So there are two types of basically buck converters, boost converters or flyback, synchronous and non-synchronous depending if they have a two switches or a combination of switch and diode. Basically when the main MOSFET or the switch is off, the current conducts to the diode instead of a MOSFET. So the advantages of non-synchronous are it's less expensive and easy to implement but it has losses in the diodes. Whereas the synchronous buck converter, the current flows through the MOSFET and the losses are less and it's highly efficient but it's costlier. So the non-synchronous buck is generally used in case of high output voltages so that the losses in the diode are not comparable to the output power or the output voltages. And in lower output voltages, a synchronous buck is used so we can achieve higher efficiency and lower losses.